It's still Monday. I'm still not looking forward to the rest of the week. And then it's going to come. And it's going to suck. Welcome in. Why does it got to be so hot? My buddy. My, my stray buddy Red. He comes by and hangs out. I hook him up with the food and some attention. He's a good kitty. He's my little buddy. He comes by. We've been hanging out for a while now. Kind of adopted him pretty much. Because I'm such a good kitty. And as you may know, I like cats. A lot. I'm a cat person. They're great. I'm a little bit of a sexist when it comes to cats, because I do do love males more than females. But that's just a personal choice. I've had quite a few female cats. Most of them um, have been all right. A few of them have been kind of very personality demons. Is it 420 yet? Oh, it's only 340. <laughs> oh, got off work on time today at 2.30. Just sitting outside. Kira's back home hanging out inside. Everything ran really well. She was only in the hospital for three days. Well, two recovery days. And yeah, that's great. I'm happy to have her home. She's already up trying to do stuff, and that's not happening. She may be doing stuff right now, but... That better not be happening, because she is fresh out of the hospital and needs to be recovering. She needs to be feeling as good as she can. Sorry about this. I just need my hand. I film everything on my cell phone. I'm too cheap to go buy a camera. Cam <coughs> Camcorder of any sort. Plus, this thing does great. I think the video quality turns out pretty nice, so there's no point. I spent eight, eight, I spent eight hundred dollars on this stupid phone. I mean, running Galaxy S6, good phone. Brought to you by the Horde. For the Horde, fuck the lions. Oh, yeah. I currently have eight. I can't only do five on one hand. But eight max level characters, which isn't a lot compared to some people. And the expansion has been out for almost a year. But for me, Jesus Christ, that's a lot. But... Unlike most expansions, this one has always been very alt-friendly on leveling. It may not have been alt-friendly to begin with. Unless you were ke keeping your alts up with your main. Just due to the, the weapon shit that they got in this one. And if you play World of Warcraft, you know what I'm talking about. And the only downfall is... It's not really World of Warcraft anymore. It's more of World of Diablo Craft. Because... Good... God, there's so much Diablo in it that it's not even funny. If I wanted to play Diablo, I would go play it, and it's free. But since I'm addicted, and this shit's like heroin, I just can't stop playing. Actually, it's because I don't have to pay for the game anymore, because I make enough in-game currency to pay for it that way. Therefore, why not, when I can just keep on getting it for free? And I've made $60 real money off of it myself. I don't know people have made more. Well, can't really say real money, but that's enough to buy the next expansion when it comes out. All from playing the game. Now, if only I could get this good at magic. 
I'm definitely getting there. Because, yeah. Getting out more, starting to read into it more. Starting to actually follow formats instead of just doing my tabletop decks, which is follows no real format at all. Decks wouldn't be the decks we I build wouldn't be viable tournament wise anyways. But I also play magic for fun. I like playing with my friends at home with their own decks built out of whatever we've been able to pull. Sometimes we go buy cards. Well I do. Uh, my buddy doesn't so much. He's a pack he's a pack opener. He likes the lottery of drawn it out of that instead of buying it which I get and he's had some good luck pulled an Olamog out of random single packs he didn't even buy a box worth of BFC to pull three I mean three Olamogs well two no two never mind two his wife pulled a foil one his wife uh nuts not only that but when freaking and, and yeah I mean he's not he's bought maybe a box worth of each set if that I don't even think that much um, he's got a little. He's got a little less. He's got less disposable income than I do. So I mean, I get it too. Um, but uh, shoot, when Ezra Moon came out, he freaking pulled a Liliana. Yeah. He always pulls the top money cards. I mean, I pulled a Gideon, but I also opened up two boxes worth of Battle for Zendikar, and now he's not worth that much, and Olmok still is. So I'm a little sad. Not to mention this guy, Mr. Caleb, Mr. Pope, had freaking like like fifteen hundred to almost two thousand dollars worth of dual lands, and we had no idea that they were worth so much. But this man, this man's a genius. He always kept those since back in the mid '90s when he ended up with them, ended up getting given them. Always kept those nicely together, so they didn't really take. They didn't really take much damage and were never really played. I mean, they were beat up, a little beat up. They are played before I got them, but they've kept that condition. And, yeah. Let's just say my jaw hit the floor. His collection's like a quarter of mine and is worth way lots more. Lots more than mine. Much more than mine. So, Caleb, if you end up watching this, which I hope I do, I hope it gets you to do, do so, because I'm sending you a link to this exact video. Yes, you, Caleb. You. I love you, buddy. It's what, 23 years, 24 years, some shit like that? It's gotta be like 23, 24. I'm gonna be 32 in, two week, in a week, a little over a week. I mean, fuck, I've known that guy. I've known him and his twin brother forever. Love those guys. Those are my freaking, those are my brothers. A lot of shit, a lot of shit happened with those guys. And without that guy, there would be no me. True status. I was very suicidal in my teenage years, and if it wasn't for that man, that motherfucker, pretty much pulling, pretty much doing what he did, I would done done away with myself. But he pointed out many things that helped me out. Not to mention just being there for me throughout all the shit I grew up with, and he knows. You know, brother, I love you. That's my fucking bro right there. But yeah. This is my little buddy Red. Ah! Alright, well. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Together, we are the sixth color of magic.